one day I was here and Mr. B was cleaning up. I think it was the end of the summer. And I said to Mr. B, oh, you have a really nice room and I see that you have speakers in the ceiling. What do you do? And I had a couple of questions for you. Have you used a microphone in other classes? Yes, I think yes. probably, first right? Grade. What, what do you like when you use a microphone? Who would like to raise their hand and tell me? What's one thing that you like about it? Um, I can hear my voice through the speakers and it's really loud. I like how people can hear my voice because if I'm trying to talk to someone, if like I'm reading this. Okay. If I did have a microphone, then nobody could hear what I'm saying. So I'm going up to page 486, materials and technology. All right, ready? Yeah. All right, let's start over here. Joseph, you think you can talk to it? Yeah. Breathe, not can make you talk too loud, is it? Tools for transportation, transporting materials. materials. Roads are very important, are a very important part of our lives. We travel on them to go to work and school. We follow them to pick up and deliver goods. We use them to visit friends and family or just see or just to see the sites. Fast, safe highways are now in place from place to place. Okay, fast is about. I want you to read this part right here. The United States began and but put up traffic signs. Good, pass it over to Jack. Oh. Roads are not the only pathways. What do you think that you like about so using the microphone? people that speak lower, the microphone can make them speak a little bit higher so they can hear them better. Okay, so you even like it so that you can hear your classmates what they're saying. Great, and then yes ma'am. I like having the microphone because usually I get shy and then I talk a little bit quiet and the microphone usually makes me loud. And why else might Mr. B use the microphone, do you think? Because maybe, one, maybe there is a word that we have trouble with and then he can help us so then we can say it out loud in the microphone so then people will know what it means. He, after he explains yeah. it. Eight or nine years ago, these were put in. This is one of the, the, this was actually the very first sound system that they had. But most of them just had the speakers mounted on the side. Right, and, and yours are in we the We worked with the surround sound, which I put through the ceiling, but normally they just get mounted on the wall or something. And um, what's good about it is because it's infrared, it's infrared like a TV, so it's line of sight. For them, the best benefit is that I can hear them. Oh, absolutely. You know, and it's it's like Sophia said, or, or Isabel said, sometimes when they, nobody minds reading. Right. They love reading. Even if they struggle, they love reading. Right. So they love having the mic, they feel like they're doing karaoke, and they enjoy themselves. Karaoke. <laughs> absolutely. And I've heard that sometimes if I walk into your classroom, I might hear some music, too. Yeah. When, yeah, he, does, he, said that, he says that music calms him down. Right. Ah, but does it also make you feel calm inside? Yeah, yeah. I, I feel like dancing. You feel like dancing. Well, it's usually the music, right? Usually, when we have like penmanship, I thought penmanship was like where you write in script. Usually, he like hits the lights and then we like watch an interesting and a nice song and then we do our work and it's very calming. 